The three affected regions contribute about a third of the country's total maize production. This year, the affected areas will produce about a quarter less than their annual production, which is estimated at just above 20,000 tons. The worms comprising of fall armyworm, African bollworm and stand borer are the main caterpillars causing havoc in the Omsati region, the two Kavangos and Zambezi regions since the outbreak at the beginning of this year. The nature of uh, fall armyworm damage is something that you cannot, a little bit a challenge to do the, the assessment uh, because you have crops at different levels of development and you don't know which one will make it to reach the harvesting stage again. Containing the worms has been a daunting task as these worms grow in three different stages. The pest is very mobile, fly long distances. For you to contain it, we are not putting nets in the air, so we are using chemicals and we, these chemicals are supposed to be sprayed by all farmers at the same time at the right stage. Yeah, the challenge now is the big monsters that are still flying around in the area. Once the temperatures come favorable to them, for them to start producing eggs, you will still might start experiencing uh, the problem of armyworms in the field. The right stage is when the worms are still young and have not entered the plants where they cannot be reached easily by the chemicals. Farmers with government assistance have been spraying chemicals on the crops to control the insects. But are these crops edible after having been sprayed with the chemicals? It can be consumed, provided the farmer is spraying recommended volumes and also leaving the period, the recommended period from your last spray before harvesting. Malawi, Zimbabwe, South Africa, Zambia and Zimbabwe are other southern countries where outbreak of worms were reported. Jeff Tashihomino, NBC News, Venduk.